Hi Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel, Unique Tarot. This is going to be your pop-up love reading for August 4th to the 5th. Okay, if you're new, hit the subscribe button and also give me a thumbs up. Any information you need to know about me will be at the in the description box. Sorry. So this is for Sagittarius. All right, in love, August 4th to the 5th for Sagittarius, please, spirit. What is the messages here for Sagittarius? August 4th to the 5th for Sagittarius in love. Love messages for Sagittarius, please. Love messages for Sag, August 4th to the 5th. Sagittarius, pop up love messages for Sagittarius, please. So we have the Tempest, that's you, Sagittarius. Oh, and the High Priestess wanted to fall out. So this is you, very balanced, waiting, very patient here, very serene energy. Okay, I'm hearing something about a, the spa. So a lot of you could be going to the spa. It could be very very cooperative healing patient energy here is what you're feeling okay and the high priestess is piscean energy could be dealing with the pisces with the hangman here at the bottom of the deck okay or definitely could be dealing with some kind of water sign because we have we have king of cups and cancer energy here so yeah all right sag all right, so yeah, very balanced, very patient energy, all right? It's, it's like very healing. It's like you're trying to heal or go within or listen to your intuition or be patient here. Or you're waiting for this Pisces. Let's see, what's the love messages for Sagittarius? August 4th to the 5th for Sag, please. Sagittarius, love messages. We have the Five of Wands. So you're conflicted here. You don't know if you should wait or if you, if your intuition, if you should listen. Okay, so your intuition, it's like you're battling with your intuition here. You're not sure what to do. Maybe something is telling you to move forward in a certain situation, but you're holding back or you're waiting or being patient. You have the emperor here, Aries energy. Okay. So this could be you, Sagittarius, in this energy. All right. Some of you could be relocating or moving here. You're back and forth on deciding whether this is a move you should make or not. All right. You're conflicted here. You're not sure what to do. You don't want to make a wrong decision here, but it's like, yeah, you're really considering here. You're trying to be patient about going down this new path, or but it's like your intuition is conflicted. It's like something is telling you to do it. Then something is telling you, you, you just don't know. What's the messages here for Sagittarius? What's the messages here for Sag and love, August 4th to the 5th? All right. Then we have the uh, Knight of Swords in reverse and then the Knight of Wands. So there, this could be, a, uh, there could be arguments, arguments and fights with the Gemini or with the Pisces or language barrier. Somebody could be foreign with the Knight of Wands. This could be somebody that's Haitian, Dominican, Mexican, whatever, foreign. Yeah, I feel like there is a, a, a language barrier or there's a anger here or a lot of coldness. The high font, two of cups, ace of swords. So some, I feel like somebody may be going from being like the knight of wands in and out to straightforward. Like somebody's very serious here. This could be you, Sagittarius, or somebody you're dealing with. But there is a, a, a connection here that you want or a relationship or you want to all right, so the Knight of Swords in reverse could be something that's not moving forward. Something just seems to not be moving forward, all right? Or your intuition is conflicted. It's like, should I wait or should I rush forward or what should I do here? All right, what is this What is this for um, Sagittarius? Love messages, August 4th to the 5th for Sag. What is the, uh, what is the, um, these wanted to flip over, yeah. I feel like you're insecure about making a move here towards someone. All right, what's the temperance card for Sagittarius? August 4th to the 5th, temperance. Yeah, the Five of Cups. So you're missing someone or you're disappointed or you're regretful here? Yeah, Four of Cups. 
you feel discontent or you feel like a missed opportunity. Yeah. Yeah, we have the Three of Swords, the Four of Pentacles, and the Empress. It's like you're confused here. Or you're not sure. Maybe you're, you're you're trying to heal something with the ex or you're unsure how to heal this. It's like you're holding on to a Libra here. Or if it's not a Libra, it's a baby mama or a wife for some of you or whoever. But you're holding on to this Libra because we have the Three of Swords in front of the Four of Pentacles and behind the Four of Pentacles. So you're uh, holding on to this heartbreak or you're wondering if this person is still holding on to this betrayal or whatever you did here. You're wondering if somebody's going to reject you. You're, you're wondering if you should express your feelings here or be honest. You don't know if somebody's going to go cold, if they're going to accept your, 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 your offer here. What's the five of cups in love? August 4th to the 5th for Sag. What's the five of cups? Okay. So you regret, like, you feel like something is not, if something's not stable, if something's not going to move forward, or you shouldn't take action, or this person is no longer attracted to you, or wants this, or can work this out. You just feel like, like something could be over here. Yeah, Eight of Swords. You're having repetitive thoughts, very insecure about moving something forward here. You, know, you are secretly watching somebody as well. Okay, somebody you walked away from or you haven't spoken to in quite some time, but you're still hung up on. What's the Ace of Wands in reverse with the Four of Wands in reverse? Yeah, the Chariot. Somebody's moved on. Or you're worried. Can't Syrian energy. Yeah, Three of Wands. You're worried that somebody's moved on or... Yeah, three of wands, seven of wands. Yeah, somebody's turned their back. They blocked you. They're going to reject you. They don't want this offer, this communication or anything. Yeah, you're really worried about this. All right. So what's the high priestess in love for Sagittarius, August 4th to the 5th? What's the high priestess in love? What is the high priestess? The eight of swords. Yeah. You really hide at how how fearful or how yeah the tower is came out Scorpio energy. So something was revealed here. You're worried about something that was revealed. Eight of Swords is like mental agony. Like I feel like you don't you can't sleep. You're worried here about about this ending. What's the tower card for Sagittarius in the Eight of Swords? tower in the eight of swords something that was hidden was revealed here yes yeah, seven of wands and somebody's blocking you or rejecting you or they have barriers up you're really worried about somebody rejecting you here like you have deep rooted fears about rejection you just cannot be rejected yeah you feel like if you offer this cup or this forgiveness or extend this apology that it's going to blow up in your face like somebody doesn't want you, they've moved on. Don't call me, do not anything. Yeah, Ten of Wands. Yeah. Feeling very burdened, just, what's the Seven of Wands and Ace of Cups? Seven of Wands, Ace of Cups in love for Sagittarius. What is this? Yeah, the Sun. In the Hierophant with the Two of Cups. So you want this, you want a relationship with someone or you want to heal something or you want forgiveness or something was revealed here. What was revealed? Yeah, the Seven of Swords. You're, you're scared that somebody sees you at the Two of that you were juggling, lying, sneaking, cheating, and juggling someone. That, that has been revealed with the Tower in the Sun here. We have the high priestess, that's secrets. Or you had somebody as a mistress or you had a Pisces you were hiding or or whatever. But somebody reveals like they know. Somebody's a high priestess, a psychic. Somebody knows that you lie. You're worried about somebody rejecting you because you were juggling them. You cheated or you lied or whatever. And they know that you did. They know that you went off and chose somebody else. 
and that didn't work out or that ended or whatever. Now you're trying to come back towards them and they know that you are. Yeah, the magician, the eight of wands, ace of swords. Now you want to take action, communicate or or something. This could be with the Gemini or Cancer or a, uh, a Scorpio or a Pisces or a Leo. Yeah, we have the Empress here again. The Empress, yeah. What is the Five of Wands for Sagittarius? What is this Five of Wands? Yeah, the Seven of Cups. So you put this person in a competitive position. You're very, I, I, I'm also getting your, your, your um, something's on fire or something blew up or you're smoking a lot or something. Some of you could be smoking a lot or you're angry about smoking or you're angry are you 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 have these fits or these blow ups or this defensiveness? You get really angry here because something is not moving forward or you're not smoking Ace of Wands because this could be a blunt and smoking here and it's in reverse. So maybe you're upset that you're not smoking or you need to smoke or your weed man is not available. Okay, that's for some of you. Anyways. You're just very upset or very in your head or very conflicted or very confused. And it's just making you angry because you don't know or there's a lot of arguing, fightings and blow ups here or you're worried about it being that because you, you're a liar or you're a sneak or you're a cheat. Yeah, the moon card. These secrets that you were hiding, these options, these people, this cheating, this lying has been revealed and somebody walked away. Somebody could even left overnight while you were asleep. They got their shit and left, or this was you. Or you're, or you're deciding to do that. What's the Seven of Cups here for? Yeah, the Three of Pentacles. So this could be something you're seeing online. Maybe something conflicting or confusing, or you're like, what is this? Or what's going on? Yeah, Eight of Wands and the Magician. This is definitely something online that confused you or angered you. Whatever you saw here, three of pentacles could be online, eight of wands and the magician. So something somebody said or uploaded or whatever, it really took you by surprise here. It really shocked you or whatever. But yes, I knew the ace of swords was somewhere here, but whatever somebody said, it was the truth. Whether it made you angry, upset or whatever, whatever someone said, it was the fucking truth. Ace of Swords, or if you said it, it was the truth. If they said it about you, it was the truth. And that's why you're angry, defensive, or mad, or you feel like things won't move forward, or this person has moved on because they see you for who you are. Somebody could have said you're a liar, a cheat, a con, you're manipulative. Somebody just has com completely no respect for you, Sagittarius, or this is you. You're very insecure and very much holding back. Trying to, you really want to communicate and, and extend yourself to somebody, but I don't. Okay, what's the Knight of Swords in reverse in love for Sagittarius, August 4th to the 5th? What's the Knight of Swords in reverse? What is this Knight of Swords in reverse? We have the Eight of Swords, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Page of Cups, so it came out. Okay, yeah. So you want to communicate. You want to tell somebody how you feel or you're texting someone or, just, or this is someone with you. Nine of Pentacles. Or you're telling somebody that they look beautiful or you like the way they, or you like the way they, they dress. You could be even be putting something online here in hopes that someone sees it. It's like you're going fucking crazy here. It's like you you do not like something here. Yeah, Eight of Cups. Yeah, the world. Somebody walked away or something is over here. Yeah, the world and the will of fortune. Seven of Pentacles, Two of Wands, and the Hierophant. Okay. The Hermit. Yeah, somebody's walking away or ghosts you or they haven't been talking to you or this is someone you haven't spoke to in quite some time. I feel like you regret walking away from someone and now you want to come back in or you want to communicate or you want to apologize or, or, or you want to explain yourself. 
Okay, because Ace of Swords is victory. You want a victory here with someone. You really want to conquer or win somebody, but it's 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 a barriers here. This person could even have you blocked. Yeah, three of wands, six of wands. This is someone online, maybe somebody that has a high following or highly celebrated or whatever. But you want to reconcile. You really want victory here with someone. What's the hermit in the eight of cups? You had a three of wands. Somebody's turned their back. They're completely went ghost or they walked away. Or this could be somebody at a distance that you walked away from. Yeah, somebody's completely cold. King of Swords, Star, and the Ten of Pentacles. All right. What's the Three of Wands? There's too many. I'm not doing this. What's the Three of Wands? Something online here that you've seen or you're watching or you're watching this person online. What is this? Yeah, Page of Swords and Queen of Wands. It's something you've seen here. Queen of Wands in reverse. Queen of Wands in reverse can be very... So this could be you, Sagittarius. You're angry or you're upset or you feel like somebody is... Uh, spreading rumors or they or or saying stuff about you that you don't like online or, or or you're stalking somebody or you realizing that somebody you're watching somebody maybe somebody's promiscuous or you're realizing somebody's promiscuous or i just feel like you're very angry at what somebody said here online all right you are very very like what's the queen of wands in reverse yeah, Ten of Cups. But somebody doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> somebody else thinks it's funny, but you're mad or you're angry or you're upset. Or you think it's funny. What is the Page of Swords in reverse? I think you're angry because you're the, you're the fire energy here. You don't like what this person said. What is the page of swords in reverse? Yeah, the fool. And the knight of cups. So yeah, I don't know. I feel like you want you you really want to reconcile with somebody or communicate, or you're posting something hoping in hopes that someone sees it or or something. Because somebody called you a liar, a cheater, a juggler, somebody that's dishonest, somebody's a fucking lame. Somebody could have said a lot here about your ass. The death card, yeah. The nine of wands. What's that knight of swords up there in reverse? So yeah, somebody's a liar. Somebody said that you're a liar and somebody spoke the truth about you being a liar. If you are, you are. Yes, yeah, six of wands. Somebody saw, said something online that you don't fucking like. And you're sitting there going over and looking at it. The world, the will of fortune. Yeah, and looking at your... What's the six of wands? Six of wands. Yeah. Nine of Wands. You're very annoyed at what somebody posted here online. Okay. Yeah, somebody called your ass out. What's the Queen of Cups? And you could be very embarrassed or you feel, yeah, the Ten of Wands and the, the Star card. What's the Ten of Wands and the Star? I feel like you're watching somebody's uploads or somebody could be in the public eye as well or have a high following here or whatever. But you're, what's the star card in the ten? Yeah, the Hierophant. I knew it. Somebody has a YouTube or somebody said something like you watched it or you were watching them or you thought you were being secret. This person knows you're watching them and they said something here that really disappointed you or really hurt your feelings or really pissed you the fuck off. You feel like you need to stand your ground or defend yourself or say something. But this person, it doesn't give a fuck. Yeah. Yeah, you're, you're upset or you're jealous or you're mad. 
or you or you are vindictive okay because look how you're looking at the justice or this libra okay something this libra said or or whatever what's the higher font in the star the higher font in the star yeah the nine of swords you're really really worried about it. whatever this is yeah six of cups this could be someone from your past what's the nine of swords yeah, you're really looking back over this in the Five of Swords. You're looking at your behavior and how you were. Or this is this other person. You know what side you on. You're looking back at your pettiness, your games, your 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 bullshit. You're really in your head about how you were and how somebody view you. They view, yeah, the Empress, this Libra. Something about a Libra here from your past that you're still in love with are you still looking at we have the emperor to the empress it could be this could be a divine counterpart here this libra sagittarius to you but there's a water sign that's in between you two or something keeping you two apart what's the five of swords seven of pentacles yeah the king of wands so I feel like you want to assert yourself or take action or you want to show somebody that you can be loyal or you can be this or that you're not what they said. Or you want to give to somebody or you want to or you're making a decision to be in this relationship or you see things from a different perspective now. What's the death card in the two of pentacles? You're seeing something different now is what I'm getting. Okay, yeah, the Knight of Wands. So I feel like you're putting an end to the juggling, the 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 player shit, the the running around. Yeah, Six of Swords. What's the Knight of Wands? Yeah, the Emperor. So you're going from the Knight of Wands to the Emperor. So you're 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 like fuck. Yeah, yeah, I've changed, or I'm not like this anymore, or. Or, yeah, what's the emperor doing? Yeah, the emperor to the empress. Okay, but this, yeah, there's a water sign. So there's a Libra here or a relation. There's a water sign that's in between the two of you. Or this could just be you. you you're going from the Knight of Wands to the Emperor to the King of Cups. So you're focused or you're devoted on this Libra or you're growing up. You realize that you need to settle down or whatever. Or you want to. What's the Empress? Yeah, the Ace of Pentacles. So you want to offer this Libra an opportunity or you want to work with them or you this person is your emotional fulfillment or something. Yeah, you're. it's like you've had an epiphany or you're seeing something different here. You're realizing you need to take action or you need to do something different here. Yeah, Three of Cups, the Lovers, and the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, six of cups. This is someone from your past here. Or you're very protective over this person or this. Yeah, this is definitely someone from your past here. Yeah, two of swords, Libra again. Yeah, this person's closed off. Maybe you were slow to offer them something or you ended something with them to be with a, a earth sign. And then that ended as well or whatever. And now you're, you're what's the six of cups? Yeah, the justice, a Libra and the strength. So, yeah. A Libra is very significant here. So you want to offer this Libra something. Or you've been holding on to this person. Or you want to go back toward this person. Just period. One more right here. Okay. Before I end this out. Because I got to go. Yeah, the Four of Swords. No communication. Nothing moving forward. Yeah, Three of Cups. You want to reconcile. The Lovers. The Three of Cups. The Ten of Pentacles. Okay. You want you want to reconcile, okay? You love you still love this person. You want a family, or you see uh, wealth and family with this person, or you're realizing this person is the one for you. After you lied, cheated, conned, and did some more shit, maybe even chose somebody else over this person. But once something didn't work out, or that went haywire, now you you're back over here. Something ended with a water sign. You went towards another water sign. You now you're you you. It's like the wheel is turned. Now you're back at this Libra again. This person from your past that you want to make this offer to. 
you want to do something right or you want to or you want to show somebody that you're better than what they're saying you really don't like what you what somebody said here what's the messages here for Sagittarius give me a few cards for Sag August 4th to the 5th love messages for Sagittarius please love messages for Sagittarius give me some love messages for Sag Okay, yeah, we have new love and wedding, okay? A new person has stirred your romantic feelings and this situation involves marriage and flirt. Yeah. Yeah. New love, so yeah. Maybe you met somebody new. New love, what's this new love card? Hey, maybe you, 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 somebody you could have secretly uh, got married or... Or something. Yeah, romantic feelings, wedding, new love. So this up, pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. So I feel like you, okay, let's pay attention to the red flags. Yeah, flirt and very soon. What is this for Sagittarius? Soulmate, playfulness, and codependency. Heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Healing family issues. So I feel like you... you um, I feel like you may want a renewal in love. Or you... Somebody does not trust you. They find you to be very toxic, Sagittarius. Or this is you. You'll flirt or fuck or do whatever with anybody. Somebody's not trust you. And they know that you went off and found somebody else as well. And did all of this. Yeah, retreat, reconciliation, trust, and true love. Yeah, so somebody retreated. They went off. Then somebody went off and, and, and dealt with somebody else. And now they're realizing that this is their true love, their true soulmate. They Now they want to come in and reconcile. Now, or you do. Love yourself first. Getting to know each other and children. Or you want to reconcile with this person from your past. Maybe you went off and thought somebody else was a better fit or was better. But you're going to, if this hasn't happened, you're going to realize that this person isn't. And that you actually want to be with this Libra. Or you want to make an offer towards this Libra. Yeah, you definitely want to reconcile with someone here. This is someone from your past. What's the higher font and the star? Real quick. Now you're worried about... Yeah, you're really worried because this person is taking off. They're doing well. Yeah, the world in reverse. Yeah, you 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 don't want something to end here, or you don't want to end out this cycle. Yeah, the two of cups, the two of wands, and the eight of pentacles. I feel like you really want to work with someone here. Yep, page of pentacles. But this person is moved. I don't I don't know. I'm going to be honest, Sagittarius. This person doesn't see you in the best light. They see you as a liar, a cheater, a con, somebody that's an opportunist and you like to use people. Straight up. A straight, a straight motherfucking loser is how somebody sees you. Straight up. Like they're blocking you. They don't want you. They don't want you to come toward them or any of that. This is what I'm hearing this person say. Like, just stay where the fuck you at. Okay? Period. But you can try... Go towards your new person that you had. Go towards them or or something. But this Libra, if this is a Libra from your past that you're trying to go back towards or give this offer to, all right, they don't want it. Just period. And then, like, I feel like you're trying to piggyback off the back of somebody else's career. You ain't even coming in with no money here. I don't see the king of pentacles or anything. The emperor is here. I don't see the King of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles, or anything. You're coming in trying to piggyback off of somebody else's success because you're an opportunist or somebody else is, vice versa. And, and this person is like, no. Yeah, you're coming in with this little offer and somebody's built up something here. Okay, Nine of Pentacles is independent. She got Nine Pentacles all by herself. The only thing the Nine of Pentacles is missing and she's the Empress is love. You went off and you tried to do something with somebody that's a whore. Queen of Wands, you're realizing somebody's a hoe. Or you've seen something or, or something. 
that makes you say, that makes you realize that now you done fucked up with the empress to go be off with a hoe. Maybe somebody that looked good or, or was younger or th that seemed to be popular at the time or whatever. Yeah, the devil. That's how somebody sees you. The devil. Very cold. And the codependent card came out too. So somebody sees you as very selfish and devilish. A very, very nasty person. What's the devil card? My head is even starting to hurt because somebody's just disgusted. Yeah, very possessive here. We have the four of pentacles. But I do feel, what's the four of pentacles and the devil? One more. Like somebody's trying to release their devilish ways or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, somebody realizing they made a wrong choice or they're leaving somebody out in the cold or, yeah, here, okay, here's the ten of pentacles. All right. Yeah, somebody's having, has, having an epiphany here. It's like they've had an awakening that they made a wrong decision or something like that. So, yeah, okay. So, those are your messages, Sagittarius. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.